Welcome. So today we are going to learn how to play the game Ecologies, which is a fun card game for the whole family. I've got my helper here just slightly off screen. Is it Sam? No. And he's going to help us learn how to play the game Ecologies. So let's go through the rules a bit. The goal of Ecologies is to build an ecosystem. So we're going to start by dividing these cards up. Each player gets a hand of seven cards. So I'm going to take a moment to look at my hand here. And one of the first things I'm going to look for is to make sure it has a biome. So one house rule is that if you don't have any of these biomes, then you can draw another seven cards. That's a house rule and it's optional. Let's see, I'm going to check to make sure. And yep, I happen to have two biomes. I've got the grassland biome and I've got the tropical forest biome. So I can build either one of those. Um, Sam, are you okay? Do you have a biome? Yep. All right. Samuel has a biome. So we're going to go first. The person who goes first does not get to draw. Um, so I go first and I'm going to start asking, let's see, I want to do some trading. Let's see. Since I have the grassland biome, I'm going to ask Samuel, hey, do you have anything from the grassland biome you'd like to trade me? He's going to offer me a zebra and I'm going to offer him a squirrel. So you want a squirrel? Sam would like a squirrel. I'll take the zebra. That's a trade portion of a turn. And then I can play up to two cards. First card I'm going to play is a biome. So I'm going to put that down. And I'm going to be building on the grassland biome. Next card I'm going to play is a biotic factor. This allows me to do whatever it says on there, which is draw five cards. Put it in the discard pile. I'm going to draw five. And Sam will get to draw one. Four, five. All right, it's five for me. He gets to draw one. Ooh, that's a good number of things. I wish I could play those, but I can't because I've already played my two cards. Next comes the discard phase. I can, hold on. I can discard up to four cards and draw one. So I'm going to pick some four cards I'm not really a big fan of here. And I'm going to throw those, whoops, <laughs> throw them gently in the discard pile and draw one card. Ooh, I got squid. That's no fun. At the end of my turn, I'm going to say, Samuel, it's your turn. He'll draw two. He can trade if he wants to. Do you want to trade? A boa constrictor. A boa constrictor. All right, I'm going to offer him a lichen for the boa constrictor. Now, I don't have to trade if I don't want to. And he can play two cards. He's playing a coniferous forest biome. And then he's going to put, what else you got? A tree. So this is a tree. It's a producer. You have to put the producers down in the right biome. So they match colors here. He's putting the pine tree as a producer in that biome. Without producers, nothing else can eat. Do you want to discard anything? He does not want to discard. So it'll move it over to my turn. I'll draw two. And ooh, I got another grassland biome. That's Yay. useless. I have a producer, but it's the wrong biome. Uh-oh. I don't have any producers. I have a zebra, but what's that zebra going to eat? I have a wild dog to eat my zebra, but without grass, I've got nothing. So I'm going to simply ask Sam... Do you have any producers for the grassland biome? Grass. You've got grass? No, I don't. No, you don't. Okay, well then, I can't play any cards this turn. Oh, dear. I'm going to have to let Sam go. He'll draw two. Trade? Uh, no, that's not very useful for me. So then he'll play two. He's going to put that tiger moth, which can eat. So a tiger moth is a C1, which means it can eat a pine tree. Is there anything else you want to play, Sam? Yes. A squirrel. That That's squirrel I traded him earlier, he's going to have it. It could eat the pine tree as well if he wanted it to. It's a tiger moth. But 
One of the options is it can eat tiger moths. So now he's beginning to build a biome. Now let's skip ahead a little bit. Sam, why don't you see if you can finish off that biome? What other cards can you play? He's going to put a garter snake also eating the tiger moth. I thought it could eat squirrels. Tiger moth. He can't eat garters. He can't eat squirrels. And he's putting a lynx to eat the garter snakes and the squirrels. Oh. And putting a black bear. This black bear is serving as a detritivore. So this is uses has the SD on the top, which means it can eat decaying biomass. So at this point, we have a producer, a C1, a C2, a C3, It's because this is eating the squirrel, and a detritivore. This is what we call a healthy ecology. And the healthy ecology is going to give him a plus four bonus points. So he's got a substantial number of points here. If you play it just by cards, he's got one, two, three, four, five, six points plus four victory points, 10 points. You need 12 points to win. You can also play using the fractions on the side if you want to challenge your mathematical skills, in which case he's got a while before he has to win yet. The goal is to reach 12 points. First player to 12 points wins. And that's how you play ecologies.